everyone and welcome to the mini toy love channel and today i have another japanese pokemon video for you guys and this time i'm mixing some english packs with some japanese packs i have this super cool lucario black star promo set in english that features three crimson invasion um sun and moon boosters I'm joined by my cute little Lucario figure there. And then I also have four different series of Japanese booster packs. One is um, Tag Bolt with Pikachu Zekrom there. Then GG End over on this side, we have Ultra Sun, I believe, and then Infinity Zone. So uh, lots of cool Pokemon cards. Can't wait to see what we get. So let's go ahead and get started. First up, I want to start with my GGN booster pack. Um, I know they have a really cool Lucario card in the series. And of course you have Giratina and Garchomp, the GG part of GGNs, <laughs> which that took me a while to figure out. But anyway, super cute. I like the set because you also have the right shoes in some of the artworks. Okay, so here's our first card. It's a trainer card. Um, we have that little Carablast cutie. Look at him just yelling all cute. I like that card. Ah, oh, Pikachu! That is a gorgeous background. Very pretty Pikachu at night. Um, Axew, one of those guys. And then, oh, it's the bigger form, as our Hollow. Oh, he's pretty cool. Very nice. And we'll rotate some of the packs from this um, cool Lucario promo. Look at how neat that artwork is. And you get a little Shaman coin. So here's our adorable coin. Love the green. And then our Black Star promo of Lucario. Look at how neat. I love the background of this card. It's the hollow circle pattern and it's the black star promo down there. Super cool and it's in pretty good shape. Um, it, you get a code card too and look at how bent the code card is <laughs> right there. Um, so I'm really glad our promo survived. The code card took the damage for us. Very cool. Love this card. And we'll start with this Crimson Invasion pack from Sun and Moon. That is definitely a set um, I did not open um, too much of back in the day. Uh, Sun and Moon's 4-2, hopefully. But still, all the Sun and Moon series are becoming harder and harder to find. Um, here we have the cute little Execute. They're adorable. I like them. Jigglypuff, also adorable. Uh, Chimcho? Chimcho? Spoink? So cute. Swablu, look at all these cuties. Fighting energy, um, a fighting memory. Alolan Graveler. Amolga, also adorable. Mankey is our reverse hollow. And then our last card, oh, it's actually uh, a rare Agron, a hollow rare. I don't remember ever seeing this card before. So yay, I'm pretty sure that one's new to my collection. Cool. And then we'll rotate back to a Japanese pack. This is Infinity Zone. Um, I'm not sure what English set it corresponds to. If it is the Sword and Shield era, I guess we should find out. But very cool. I always love the pack art um, on the Japanese cards. So, so gorgeous. Um, we have a monkey. Uh, pan ah, it's a green monkey. Teddy Ursa. Um, that little guy. The hippo, hippo toss. <laughs> oh, wow. And we have none other, um, than, uh, Eternatus V. That's really cool. So this was the series, um, with him. So definitely the V cards. This is a sword and shield set. Very nice. Love the colors going on with the darks and of course the black borders on the V cards are really cool. We got my Mimikyu sleeves, so in you go there. I think this card is or was pretty playable. I'm not sure about now with all the different styles going on. Back to a Crimson Invasion. Oh, that one just tore right open there. I didn't really like the Ultra Beasts, and I think Crimson Invasion was when that those were kind of introduced heavily, um, which is probably why I never opened too many. Um, we have Corefish, that's actually really cute artwork. Pumpkaboo, Salandit, Feebas, oh, Cubone, always adorable. It's walking on a bridge over a valley there. <laughs> cute. Fairy Energy, Lizamine, oh, she's cool. I like her. Um, Kakuna, look at those little cuties hanging from from trees or vines. I don't know, they're adorable. Selgor, Altaria is our reverse hollow. Um, I think it's reverse hollow rare. Look at the artwork on Altaria. It's actually really cool. And then we have a regular rare Beedrill. 
Okay, let's grab Ultra Sun from um, the Japanese sets for Sun and Moon. I always love um, what Desk Mane Necrozma, Sol Galeo. I like that character a lot. Okay, so here we have a Rotom. Is it a little handheld fan? We have a little leaf something. Oh, this little cutie. Um, is it Tortoise or something? I don't know. Uh, another monkey. And then a Salazzle. I believe that's Salazzle. Very cool artwork. She's, she's slinking around. <laughs> On to our last English pack for Crimson Invasion. And let's see what we get. So, another little Cubone, Feebas, Salandit, um, Carablast, oh look at he's not yelling in that one. Okay, he's cute. I like that artwork. Very cool. Jigmo, um, Darkness Energy, Psychic Memory, a Dashing Pouch, um, Kakuna, Mawile is our Reverse Hollow. Cool, I love the Reverse Hollows on Sun and Moon. Um, not on Sword and Shield. And then our last card is a regular Miss Magus. And then the last pack for the video is a Tag Vault. Um, part of the tag team from Sun and Moon. Love that set. Um, I believe you can get Mimikyu in this set, which I am hoping for. Okay, so first up we have a very cool looking Beedrill. Oh my goodness, little, little Charmander. That's adorable artwork. Um, Nidoran female uh why am i blinking um <laughs> no dratini um no uh dragonair dragonair is a stage one yikes <laughs> not being able to see the name it's it's stressful and then our last one yes very nice we have a hollow charizard love the hollow design on japanese cards and that is some really sweet artwork very cool. Totally forgot that Charizard um, is in the series, even though we just pulled a Charmander. My bad. <laughs> Here's another look at everything we opened today. You guys will have to let me know which was your favorite card or favorite art style from the cards we opened today. Um, feel free to leave me a comment down below. These are always fun to look at, and I love mixing up the sets and looking at the different artworks over the different series. Um, I lined up some of my faves on the back. I really love that Altaria artwork and super happy about the Charizard Hollow as well. So that'll do it for this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Feel free to subscribe. You can also check out my Pokemon playlist for more videos such as this one. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.